Uh, any more conduits here? Oh man, you got. Oh man, that is suck, dude. Went fly and slam into the building. Where are you? Where are you? Okay, he's dead. Probably where it is, or at least the general area of it. Oh, great. Freaking. I just mistake that tree for a conduit. I am really, like, not focusing very well or something, because I literally just mistake that tree for a conduit. This is just your typical hidden package mission. We've done quite a few of them now. Simply go to the area and find the package. And no, I'm not going to make a sexual joke out of that, okay? I don't feel like doing so right now, even though maybe some of you wanted me to. Mentioning last week about a young life. But first, I have got to say, what is wrong with North Carolina freaking weather? Like, it was literally like 50 last weekend at the day this is being recorded. And now it has been snowing for the past 22 hours. We have like nine inches of the stuff. It's like, what the heck? Like, seriously, what the heck? What is wrong with our weather? It does not make any sense whatsoever. And I went too far. Okay, uh, now that I've got that rant out of the way, oh, and not to mention it's supposed to be like 50 in a couple of days again. It's like, seriously, we have the strangest freaking weather. It, go, it literally shoots from 50 one day to 20 the next. And then we get like 10 inches of snow. It's like, this is just so weird. Anyway, now that that rant is out of the way, Look, let's begin a side mission. This video is going to be dedicated to the remaining side missions of the Warren. There's four. Now let's get back to our side missions. So I think there's either maybe three to five left, I think. Okay, Cole, now you're starting to piss me off. You're supposed to shock it, not do that. Okay, seriously, how hard is this to do? Okay, this is, thank you, jeez. How long does it take to shock one stupid device? Seriously, bring a little electricity. Hey, come on, come on, machine gun. Oh, what now, what now, what now? Aside from the fact that there's like 10 others of you that are still killing me. Oh crap, I didn't think there was another one. Ha uh -huh. God, I love that. It's like, we can't shoot through the shield. What do we do now? Okay, I was hitting L2. I don't know why he wouldn't drain electricity. Oh man, crap, there's a freaking conduit up there. How exactly did that kill me? I had the shield up and was at full health. So, but it's so annoying. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Let me lock up in prison. The stupid TV jackers trying to insult us yet again, even though technically it was all Zeke's fault. And like Invisible and I were talking about, it's like, oh, the government's your number one enemy. And it's like, usually, yes. But when you have a Zeke, then you have a new number one enemy. I think we can all agree on that, that Zeke is your number one enemy. A Zeke is your number one enemy. Okay, so there's a lot of enemies down there. Uh, let's see, am I nearing it? Yes, I am. Yeah, I remember this one. This is a pretty easy hidden package. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That idiot just blow up all of his friends. Nice job, dude. You just killed, like, all of your team. You actually had a decent ambush on me, but it's like, nope, nope, I'm just going to blow up everyone on my team. Oh, you've got to be freaking kidding me. Doucher dropped his hidden package right down there. Well, I might have to kill myself now. I didn't have a choice. The guy freaking fell off. Really? By that point, you could probably get either one or two more battery cores. 
And I mean, it can never hurt to have a little more battery. Thank you. And I know exactly where this where this uh, one is. It's actually right next to us. Thanks well, not right back. next to us. You've been very helpful. <laughs> exactly, Cole. That was actually a pretty good way of saying it. Okay, let's kill off some of these enemies. Not go that way, so... Cole is going to have to parkour his way across the bridge. There's something wrong with your phone. Every time I try and call you, I get disconnected. I don't have time to let text Figure it out yourself. Oh, Cole's telling her off. That's right. That's what happens, Moya, when you lie to the super-powered man that can wipe out the entire, like, U.S. and just rest of the world's militaries probably on his own. Especially with the help of a couple conduits. Oh, dang, that's gotta hurt. He fell in the freaking fire. That's gotta suck. Ugh, I, feel, I actually feel a little sorry for him. I guess I got a little caught up in ranting about Moya there for a second. There we go, okay. All of our enemies are dead. We're off to a good start. I probably should not have said that out loud. did not look good. Alden's like destroyed the entire freaking bridge, so we're going to be in the same scenario we were in last time where there is no way to get back to another district until we have finished this off. Yeah, clearly you were pretty dangerous actually. Oh no, 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 no. I knew I shouldn't have said that out loud. Dang it. That's not a good start. Okay, now hopefully that I said that, things will go a little better. Okay, shoot another RPG at me. I dare you. Oh, now you're afraid to do it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, you're not afraid to pop three machine guns, though. But then again, as soon as I get behind you, it's not like you can actually do anything. Uh, there is not a... Okay, this is not going well at all. Yeah, crap. Well, at least we restart right on this phase of the battle, so it's not really that big a deal. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, can't do anything to me when I do that, Mr. Uh, Alden Man. I would say the Karmic Overload is a good choice. What? I had the shield up, though. What the heck? Okay, seriously, game? I had the shield up. That is crap. So, like I said, on everything except for my hard difficulty playthroughs in the past, Alden has been probably the toughest boss. Case in point, I was draining energy and he still killed me. This is really not going well. Okay, pull the shield out, thank you. Okay, there we go, we did it right that time. And we've got him. After like, way too many fails. And your thief of a friend! All of you! Cutscene. Alden no longer seemed like a threat to anyone. Just some old guy howling about how Kessler had stolen his first son birthright. Then he changed his tone. He claimed he wanted to work with me to get revenge. To join the forces and kill Kessler. The guy must have felt my hesitation. Because in that moment of indecision, I jumped. No normal man could have survived that fall. But Alden's a conduit. Same rules don't apply. Either way, this thing's coming to a head. My enemies are all gathered here in the historic district. Kessler's preparing them for the final battle. Yeah, this is the finish line. Just wish I wasn't crossing it alone. 